Welcome to Harf's own hotel. This is Danny Lowe, and we're glad you're here. During the hero selection, after seeing Gallowix, Elementals, and Murlocs, our champion, Brad OBG, immediately exclaimed, Nice, I free win. This was inspired by Dog Dog, where in one of his last videos he did the same thing. You can find the link to his video in the description below. So let's see what's about to happen in this crazy game. Trade Prince Gallywix loves to buy and sell cars. This makes compositions like Pirates, Elementals, Menagerie, and even more locks really good. Because after you sell a minion, you get one extra gold coin next turn. So buying tokens early on is what we want. Another battle behind you. We are tempted to buy the second alley cat right away, but in the end we prefer to opt for a level up plus freeze. Often enough, a standard curve is one of the best for this hero. Into their hearts. Leveling aggressively is pretty bad with this hero, so we double by with scavenging Hyena to stabilize the boar. Now, at turn four, we can use our boosted economy to buy and level up. At five, we can find three prime minions for Trade Prince Gallowix, like Bran, Magma Lock, or Chef Nomi. So let's try it. We level up, double sell, and buy the triple. Here we were a bit unlucky, but Mama Bear is, for the moment, the minion that most of all has the potential to stabilize the boar in the coming turns. Now we need to buy some minions to survive as we look for a way out. Treasure Seek Release seems a very good compromise. After all, we need to gain traction. Also, giving Reborn to Mama Bear seems another good way to spend our economy at Tier 4. Thanks to Elise, here is Bran, minion invaluable because from next turn we could start to cycle our economy well to kick off the real power level of Gallowix. Also, as our finishing move, we play Faceless Disciples Battle Cry on our Tier 4 Reanimating Rattler. Thanks to Bran, we end up with the Tier 6 minion Sharoga. Free buffs.
In this turn eight, we bet everything to go to Tavern Tier 5, where Gallowix performs best and cycle as much economy as possible for the next turn. So we try to play minions that allow us to move as many resources as possible to the next turn, but without going too much to the detriment of our board. This will be the decisive round. Since we have cycled a lot of economy, Magmalock is, for example, an excellent minion with which to close this turn. Turn 9, what we are definitely looking for is another Magma Lock and some beasts. Magma Lock allows us to set up a winning strategy, while adding beasts that synergize with Mama Bear allows us to survive. Look closely at this turn because this is where the real game begins. With 25 gold coins, we are ready to switch this build in something way better. Ouch, we barely got away with it. Finally, the strategy is clear. Thanks to all the economy Gallowix can generate each turn, we can make Magma Lock, Master of Realities, Bran and Ball of Minions work together to get a massive comeback. Let's have fun with this OP composition.
to make sure we don't miss anything. We also include recycling RAF to take advantage of the mechanics of free refreshes. This will make our build unstoppable. We continue buffing our build and close with Tunnel Blaster, perfect for us since we are without Divine Shields. The opponent, on the other hand, playing full elementals, is likely to have a pair. Let's go for this free win. And thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed your stay, and we look forward to you being our guests again soon. Greetings from Hearthstone Hotel.